What is up everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Harris. I'm once again joined by Justin and today we're going to be reacting to episodes 87 and 88 of Hunter Hunter. Yep, that's right guys. The last two episodes, so uh, really just 85 was nuts. Like, totally turned the meter up with everything, raised the stakes on the show. We got introduced to Kite at the start of the arc and then nine episodes in, dead. So it's like, yeah, these ants are no joke. Well, I'm guessing Nefropito, it looked like she was challenged because as we found out in 86, she wants to fight Kite again. So I'm guessing Kite put up a yeah. challenge. So, But it didn't look like she was injured or anything. So I have no idea how strong she is. And then we got introduced to the two other royal guards at the end. Well, I should say we got the name of one of them who's still in like the egg whatever hatching. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that one was like Mithro Yupi or something. And then Yeah, it, it was some like some long ass name but once again once we see who man man or whatever the name is like <laughs> yeah. we're gonna find out like what pokemon i'm gonna call it <laughs> yeah. or something like that and then uh, we, we also got introduced to yeah. the the butterfly yeah as you call him shia labeouf shia shia... i think is real name shia poof shia poof shia boof but <laughs> i'm gonna say shia labeouf shia labeouf all right i mean he kind of he passes him from what i remember like he got that similar sort of face but uh, that's our nickname for him so, I just know everybody's gonna be so fucking mad every single time that I'm calling people the wrong names here, so... Okay, we do know the names, guys, but we're just giving nicknames to everybody, kind of... Come like, on, it's for the content, Yeah, bro. make it for the meme at this point. It's uh, similar how we do with Jinge, and uh, I think his <laughs> name was... Uh, now I forget how to pronounce his real name. Jing, I think, right? It's Jing. Yeah, yeah so it's we do Jing, know. But we still say Jin. Even yeah. though some people on our Patreon have been happy this, that like that we call him uh, Jin. Yes, yeah, so keep, keep up with the meme. But we got all of that now, <laughs> and now we're getting closer, I guess, to probably the big confrontation because we got a timeline now. We had Netero and two other hunters show up, Morel and Nov. So I'm yeah. guessing that those two are like the highest ups right after Netero to try to take out the situation because we don't want to send like a lot of people as we found out because that's just more food for the queen. So they just sent yep. the bare minimum <laughs> and the strongest, right? Yeah, it, you know what's also wild is that Netero, I think himself said like the Royal Guard is stronger than him or something. True. Which makes me very worried, right? I mean, we already saw how nasty Nefropito was when she just looked off in the distance like, Hey, there's my prey here, and then just severs Kite's arm, like, straight up. I'm just like, dude, wh wh what's gonna happen now when the king shows up? I'm still, like, worried about the king. Um, their mission is to stop it from being born, right? That's what they're here to do, so we'll see if they could do that. Because, like, if the royal guards are this strong, right? <laughs> king is, they're hyping the king up to be in a different universe in terms of strength. Right, yeah. So, I guess we'll have to see, but... We have everybody that I, I we haven't even talked about God and Killua yet, right? And now we're, we're right. finally gonna get to it. It's like they got sent back because they're not ready for this, right? So they had to train nope. again, and then we got Bisky back into the story. Bisky's back. We also got Cookie Chan back yeah. last episode, yeah. which was great. I love to see Cookie Chan. Um, the boys have to train. They gotta do something in order to stand up. Otherwise, they're gonna just end up like Kite and just like get bodied. Yeah, there's just a certain level of power they need, and like now Bisky's there to help them, and it looks like their test is gonna be, they have to be two of, I guess, people that were also trying to follow uh, Morale, Nav, and uh, Metro, but like they yeah. were saying that, oh, you guys aren't ready, so then it's, the training is kind of like a test for each group. <clears throat> so we got introduced to two new characters, uh, Knuckle and Shoot, and then Gon and Killer have to, I guess, beat them in a fight or something. And then whichever group, I guess, comes out on top will be worthy enough, so to speak, to go yeah. and help them. They'll get, like, some sort of... I, I forgot what it was, but it was, like, a puzzle piece or, like, some sort of... Um, They're like a tablet, almost, that connects A tablet with, yeah. kind of thing, yeah. So that's kind of, like, their reward, I guess, once they beat them. But um, we, I have no idea what's going to happen, man. Like, this arc has been crazy. Like, I, I say it in every single episode. It's just, like raising the stakes up even more and more. We're just finding an enemy that is just way too powerful right now. It's like, who knows what's gonna happen. But um, if you've been liking Hunter Hunter, I know a lot of you have. Be sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you wanna see the full uncut reactions, and if you wanna see us like, we're, we're up like episodes ahead on our Patreon. So once again, join the Patreon, link will be down below. You can stay up to date with us and you can support us more on there as opposed to here on YouTube. So uh, shout out to all the patrons, once again. We got a lot of them. We got a lot of new ones. We really, really appreciate you guys. And uh, with that, let's check out these two episodes. Whoa, her stomach got big, though. Is that a Mewtwo? 
Bisky over there reading her hentai magazine. Cookie Chan, come back! Alright, what's the next training? It's like when you run a marathon and you're like, Alright, let's go next thing, let's go to the gym. Yeah. Oh. What? Wait, she gonna make them fight after they're tired? Okay. I am I guess confused. Let's go! <laughs> like she said, let's go! Uh oh. Oh, boys have the rent on, let's go! Wow, look at that. I'm surprised I can even do it after like using it for three hours. Bye bye, dog. <laughs> oh, he, he, under, he looks like he underestimated them. Oh, oh yeah. I, I think it's because they're kids. He thought they'd be like adults. Yeah. Uh, let me see what uh -oh. you got, Nako. Let me see. Uh oh. Look at Maybe this he's just very confident. I mean, he's just the jobber. He must be good, obviously, if Zetoro and those guys think he's worthy enough to be there, right? Like, he's gotta have some skill. Yeah, he could tell that they're worn out. He knew. <laughs> oh, he's pissed that he, he thinks they underestimated him. Wait, what? Wait, hang on. Why are you crying, bro? <laughs> Is this guy like a gentle giant or something? He's a gentle I do. I think he's like a gentle giant type of guy. I see. Huh? <laughs> 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 I uh, Nako didn't expect this. <laughs> hey, he did say punch. He right? did, yeah, he did. He, he did. he has to take it. He has to fucking take it. Exactly, if he uses code, yeah, exactly. he, he has to pick the right spot or he'll die. <laughs> yeah. 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 You said you wouldn't dodge. Yeah, you. Oh my god. Bro, I think Knuckles shitting himself right now. Unless this is a bait. Oh, he got him. So, uh, so he, he did hit him in the gut. Right? Yeah, he must. Oh, wait, no. That's. Oh, damn. Look how far he went. Yeah, you're right. He went for the gut. He trusted he'd go for the gut. Yep. So that's where he put his call. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I think he's knocked out. <laughs> A departed spirit? <laughs> <laughs> this guy's gonna be funny. So much underestimating right now. To be fair, if I thought, like, if I'm probably, well, he's 20 probably, and I see two 12-year-olds pull up, and I've been training for how many times, I'd be like, come on, I wouldn't expect much. Yeah, like, uh -huh. it, it doesn't make sense, right? If, the, it, like, yeah. the point of the exercise is to be able to beat them, like, defeats the, like, if they do it cheaply and they go, then they're just gonna lose there. They want to be able to do it fairly, which I, I understand, because... Yo, know, is this gonna be like part of our group for this arc? Noko's gonna join? I like this guy. The dog followed him? I hope he doesn't like shit on his bed. Bro, I Oh, look at that little guy. I like Knuckle, bro. I like Knuckle. Uh, I, I like Knuckle. Oh, Palm's not gonna be happy with the enemy. Oh, <laughs> oh hey, 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 hey. What are you doing with that? Alright. Yo, Knuckles is very confident. Ah, oh, our man Hashish out there with the smoke. <laughs> That's what we call that. Nice bud. Oh! Oh, it's a warp world? So it looks like in a, like a separate dimension. Oh, this is how he can just fight them one by one, I guess? I guess, yeah. This is how he fucks them up. Wow, he actually sends them to the Shadow Realm. What the hell is going on here? 
Oh, they're gonna yeah. resurrect them. I think Kite is gonna end up being like a zombie. I'm surprised they got this fucking getup so soon. Like the tube, the machinery. I mean, they probably use Peggy, who's like a genius at this point, reading all his books. Okay. Oh, it's just like things don't go as planned. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go fight Knuckle again. <laughs> I wonder why Bisky doesn't go. Here we go. Alright, let's kill we're gonna fight this time. I'm curious why Knuckle doesn't train. He must be very confident. And episode ends. Not Never even mind. a change oh, oh. of stance. Woo! Oh! Oh shit! Bro, I don't even oh. think Knuckle is using like Nen or his Ren. He's just going all physical strength. Yep. They're definitely not going to be ready to like beat him until like the last day, right? That's where we're going with this. I, I, I think that's probably, uh, that's probably accurate. And we haven't even seen shoot yet, which is another thing. Like, what is? Oh, bro, they're not at his level. Oh, fuck! Is that him? Is that shoot? Lost again. They get their ass kicked. Use those walking sticks, boys. <laughs> that looks like me after a full uh, full ten hours of work. Oh, here we go. Yo, have some dignity, shoot. Oh, he's hesitating. Oh, he has some honor. Come on, dude. Cheating means that you care about your grade. Come on, bro. 100%. Dude, he, he looks like in pain. Uh, Holy shit. Can't do it. He got the lines. The attack on Titan lines. Attack on Titan lines, bro. Pull out the gun. Oh, he has a soft spot, too. He's crying. He's a softie. Shoot <laughs> Oh, he was coward? afraid, bro. <laughs> what? You, why would what we send him to fight the ads, man? Stay home. Wow, what the hell? These are these are the two best students that he has, man. I mean, Knuckle seems pretty strong. I don't uh, shoot. No, we can't send somebody like that in there. Shoot. My God. Well, in terms of physical ability, he'd be a match for Kite. What's the? How strong is Knuckle? Oh, shit. Oh, they're saying Knuckles too soft? Yeah, oh. Yeah, he is he's a softie, though. I like him. He is a softie. <laughs> oh, look at all the fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Knuckle, you're rising up the ranks in my character tiers. You are rising. Yeah, I, I like him too. My favorite's probably, uh, my favorite's still Killua, but I'm gonna put Cookie Chan at, like, number two. <laughs> how many books have you gone through there, Bisky? How many, how many, like, Yaoi books that has she gone through? <laughs> it's, it's crazy that she's a fucking enhancer. Like, uh, Oh god. Hey yo, what the fuck? Oh. Yeah, Bisky, <laughs> get ready to get the fuck out of there. Take your men's fashion magazine and get out. Uh, she looks like she makes some good food though. <laughs> yo, Bisky, I hope you got that escape plan ready. It might be time to dip. 
Are we gonna see like uh, strong biscuit? <laughs> I find myself gripping a kitchen knife <laughs> to calm Staring myself. At to calm myself. <laughs> I'm about to break everything you said. <laughs> yes, dinner. Dude, my man just wants to eat, bro. Thank you, prompts. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm sorry, a thousand needles? Yeah. A kiss. Oh, oh my, oh my god. god. Shotokan. Yo, God putting the moves on Pop. <laughs> wow. Look at, look at this. Just like, yep. Khan's getting good at it. Yo, player god. Let's go, player god. Look at that fucking chicken, dude. Rooster. Hey, yo. <laughs> Mr. Popeye. Yo, that chicken rooster is funny. <laughs> Hey, look, Porky Pig! Oh, I patch. That's Porky Pig all grown up. This is a thick ass, dank fucking clouds, man. I'm just waiting. A formation. So, uh, I'm assuming the, the one in the back is gonna die first, right? Yeah, I'm just waiting for the yoink. Yoink, yoink. <laughs> Shadow Realm. So what is his range on this? Can he just do it anywhere he wants, or does he have to be in the area? Oh, you're next. <laughs> you're next, huh, jobbers? Oh wow. Okay. So he's still the strongest, and I think he said last episode too that he's about half his strength from his prime. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. I'm starting to regain my touch. Bro, I'm gonna need some Netro flashbacks from his prime. <laughs> I'm gonna need to see that. Now I wonder if he could actually fight Nefropito. I, I bet he could. Yep. They need somebody to teach yeah. them about Nen. Oh, now's the time. Okay. They're ready? Now's the time. A little over a day. Whoa, okay. We passed that month real quick. All right. Yeah, that's true. No excuses now, so you'll, you'll see for sure. What are they missing? Oh, damn. Can Knuckle feel the difference? The the cloud is huge. It's not that, and that's also not one of Moral's dank clouds. Yeah, you can feel the difference. All right, this is going to be a serious fight. What does that look like? Ugh. Like it's leaving the umbilical cord. Oh. Ooh. oh, it's a macho man. It's a cockroach. Wait, oh, it's Kite. So she was able to bring him back. He's a puppet. He's a puppet. Is, the, is that Royal Guard the puppet master? Who is this macho man? Oh, hiya, Yuki. All right, that's easier. We're calling him Yuki. Okay, so I mean, Menfu to Yuki. Yeah, well, I'm sticking with Yuki. All right, all right Yuki is good. Okay, so they have one day to get this token, but they don't know who Shuki is. Well, yeah, that's what I asked him. Ooh. 
Do I want to see Knuckle get serious? Oh, there it is. Oh. Oh my god, Knuckle is strong. Oh no. Oh no. I get serious after five. There it is. Finally see Knuckles Ren. That's what I've been waiting yeah. to see. Yeah, they've gotten smarter now. Why keep sending people out if they're gonna not make it back? The old man. Oh, so they're, I guess, technically Netoro students. Oh, so he has faith in them. Interesting. Gotcha. Alright, relax, Moro. You don't know Gon and Killua. あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ。あ、それ
I was gonna say Knuckle and him kind of balance out each other because Knuckle's kind of aggressive but good, and Chu's kind of a coward. Um, yeah. So I wonder how they work together. I guess maybe they don't work together because we we saw Knuckle kind of going solo there. Um, but we only have one day left, as we saw in this last episode. So whatever fight this is gonna be, it's probably gonna be our last fight. So we'll probably get a conclusion between what's gonna happen in the next couple episodes. Um, and as we found out this episode, Knuckle has already pointed out two flaws with rock paper scissors. I mean, well, there's one yeah. obvious one, right? Like the charge. Yeah. Who the fuck is gonna let you charge that up? I'll just attack Who's, you if I. I mean, they're gonna see you just be like, huh? Like it's like you're playing a fighting game and you're doing like this freaking focus attack or whatever there no one's gonna let you do that no one's gonna let you gonna pull that off I, ge so. I guess if you don't know what it is you might hold back because why would you go in blind against somebody charging because you just don't know but like since yeah. no i mean dude if someone's holding their fist on their side and then just going like uh, it's just like but, but i mean with nan stuff. it could be anything right so you just don't know but knuckles already seen uh, the attack maybe. right so he's like, oh, yeah, I've yes. seen it, so I know. So I guess you have to see it first, but once you see it first, it's obvious weakness. And I mean, what do you think the second one is? Um, he said two. Has he been able to like rock, paper, scissors and then turn around and punch somebody or it has to be directly in front? I don't know. Like, I don't think I've ever seen flexible? him turn around. Is he flexible with it? Like, cause I feel like once he charges it up, he just punches, right? I don't remember. I I forgot. He's changed. All I remember is once he's charged it up, he's changed. Like he's charged up, but then gone scissors. It wasn't rock, right? Or gone paper. So, I guess if he can change it up like that, I would assume he could point it in Whoa. a different direction, right? So, does he have to go rock, paper, then scissors, or is it like rock, scissors, then paper, or is, it, is there like a specific order? That's a good question. I don't know. Like, and then I'm trying to figure out how would Knuckle know that? Like, Knuckle, ha Knuckle identified the two weaknesses after seeing him use it, right? So, I was like, how would Knuckle know that? Um, because there's always like, there's always like a, a drawback with some sort of ability, right? So well, yeah. I feel like, I feel like Gone goes in order, maybe. That could be it. Maybe he uses too much power. Maybe it's like it's a one shot. So not only can yeah. I attack you when I use it, but then if you, if uh, you miss or like I dodge or something, then it's like you have no power left. Yeah. Maybe that's okay. Two so, so it's like a it's like a V move or whatever you call yeah, it. Yeah, basically it's like all in one with the... from from Sun and Moon or whatever, like the the GX attack like from Pokemon. Yeah, it's basically a, a glass cannon, no backup. So I, yeah, I, I think those are the two weaknesses. Oh. I guess we'll probably find out next episode. Um, something I found people, interesting. Oh, people, ahead. I've been saying like as we're thinking of these theories, people are cringing right now, 100. percent Oh yeah, it was like uh, I know for some of our other shows, we kind of throw things out there that are way out left field that don't end up happening. Sometimes we hit like in the gifted, we hit. Sometimes on, we hit. We yeah. hit on quite a few of them actually. I think we got. Yeah a lot between the gift and the gift of graduation right but it's hit or miss sometimes <laughs> you gotta gotta get to the plate and swing to get some things right right so you're definitely gonna do wrong and right as we go through um i'm trying to see anything else i guess i mean both mostly these two episodes were just kind of training getting up to the point um oh i guess the last royal guard is out right up yep um, up Men's the wrath of a Yuki. Yeah. <laughs> so. and it turns out he's just some big macho man. Like he looks like a freaking Machamp or something. But not 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 with minus the the two extra arms. But you know. So I'm guessing he's he. They're all probably specialists, right? Because that would just make sense since I guess uh, P sure. Pito was a specialist and they all seem like strong. Like it would make sense that they're probably all specialists. But I was gonna yeah. say if just by looking at him, he looks like an enhancer. The Shia LaBeouf guy, or Shia Poof, I'm not sure what he is. He's got some weird vibes going, so I can't really put it. He's probably special yeah, too. Yeah, so. I, I want to say, like, I, wanna, I feel like Manipulator. Um, I could see that with the violin. He can manipulate people. I could definitely see that. That's a good call. So I think we could see those there. Um, or but, maybe, like, uh, maybe he can conjure something. I, uh, that too. Those are two. Anything with, like, when you have, like, uh, an apparatus or something you use, it's, like, Manipulator or Conjure, I think. But yeah, too, oh, I guess before we wrap up, we should mention too, it looks like Palm is getting a little crush on Gon. I don't know how old Palm is. We're going to need an FBI open up situation, but... Shotokans, bro. There's too many Shotokans. We got Palm and Hisoka. Even though everyone's just like, Hisoka's just turned on my power. And I'm like, nope, he is a pedophile. Okay, I was with the people that turned on my power to that, I think, episode 68 or whatever, when he looked at their butts. I was like, all right, bro, I was on He's your side pedophile. with the power, but right I then... Give, I don't give a 
Fuck what you say, pedophile. Uh, that, that was not good, so... We'll see if Palm kind of falls into that category. Like I said, I don't know how old she is, but... This is the, it, it's, it's the Shotokan, the Shotokan trope. Uh, it's just, I guess, they have to have it in this, so... Yeah, and it looks it's like it Gon's a player, too. He's making the moves on Palm unknowingly. Um, but yeah, two solid episodes, guys. It looks like we'll probably wrap up the little mini training arc we're getting in the next episode. Maybe we'll see Knuckles' Nen ability, too, because I'm interested to see what category Knuckle falls in. Um, is Shoot gonna come out of hiding? Who knows? But yeah, uh, that's gonna do it for us. Don't forget to drop that like down below. Let us know in the comments what you guys thought of these episodes. And like Harris mentioned in the beginning, we do have a Patreon. So if you are interested in seeing our full-length reactions to this and all the other th shows on the channel, you can check out the link down below. And yeah, is there anything you want to wrap up? Nope, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching this uh, week's episode of Hunter Hunter. And we will see you all in the next one. So until then, y'all take care and have a good one. Peace.